hello collective welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for your likes your comments your shares and your subscribes i truly appreciate them all let's see what's going on what's the messages for you guys what do you need to know what you need to be aware of beginnings what do you need to know what you need to be aware of so we have the chariot moving forward something is moving forward traveling plans you could be traveling you could be moving forward here in life but having the structure and discipline that is needed you need to stay the course that's what I'm hearing all right in a situation yeah it could be a high priestess somebody knows um at the around the full moon here there's going to be good a divine feminine is going to have a rebirth whoever abused their power is starting to see things your way yeah they know it's time's up for reconciliation so it's giving like somebody knows something is going to move forward around a certain time because you had the structure discipline to do so um good things i'm hearing good things come to those who wait so you could have been waiting for something that you felt like never was going to come okay um something is finally going to move forward for you okay and somebody knows that they're a little somber about it but it's like man all right like seeing things your way like they may not agree with something, but it's just like, all right. So humility, somebody has uh, found some coof within themselves, okay? Not saying this person that lacks class or any of that, but the reasoning behind something is just like, all right, man. Somebody's taking time to reason with themselves is what I'm hearing. Yeah. It has something to do with a lover. Lover situation. And that song I'm hearing, I'm hearing in my mind right now is uh John B. Uh something for uh I forgot the name of the song. Don't he say don't listen to what people say? You're my angel, something like that. I don't know, but y'all know. <sighs> yeah. So somebody knows something is moving forward. It has maybe this has something to do with love. Got the chariot here. What about the chariot? You could be dealing with a Cancer or a Scorpio or you're a Cancer or a Scorpio. Okay. Somebody is concerned. Wow. Lovers and concern. Somebody is concerned. Said something about love. Somebody is concerned here now about their lover, about a lover situation. Main male. Official person. Yeah, somebody knows that somebody is somebody's official person. Hmm. The part is going to take a lot of trust from you for us to make it through. Somebody just want to love you or something like that have really uh, deep feelings for you but they could have been hiding them hmm. okay y'all what's the message okay we got problems Confusion and insecurity clouds. So there is some sort of problem here. Trouble in paradise. Mm -hmm. 
Mm. There was some sort of... Somebody could be confused now. There was a painful ending in the situation. Troubled relationship. Insecurities. Confusion and problems. Painful ending. So somebody is wishing that, hoping that their insecurities didn't ruin this connection with you. But there could have been a painful ending here. The clouds and coughing to something that was so beautiful. Dying in love. What else? Hmm. So there's some distrust here. Untrustworthy friends lying. They could be ending stuff with untrustworthy friends that cause confusion in this situation. Yeah. This person could have been high in their emotions about how somebody was attracted to you or how somebody is attracted to you. They understand that you are went through a transformation here. You could be ready to settle down and somebody is ready for to be faithful. But they could have chose a path that was unclear situationship here. Thinking that they would get victory and success here with emotionally abusing you or causing delays or obstacles to something so beautiful. This is a past life relationship. Somebody's been keeping tabs on you online here. They're afraid you're going to reject them. You know, but, you know, if they don't give you security or if they don't give you the whole, you know, and how I'm seeing this person face, like, they could have dreads or something. Okay. But they afraid that you all reject them or something, like. Due to maybe something that happened. Maybe you don't trust them or something. I don't know. They've been keeping tabs on you online now. What else? Choices. Um, somebody's choosing to change from this narcissist energy. Some fast development is happening here. Yeah, something is changing very quickly, and somebody's like, they don't want to be who they was, or they don't want to be a certain way no more. So this was like a player, y'all. Somebody done with that shit. You know? Like, somebody want to be happy, you know? Or, um, somebody could be going through the dark night of the soul. Somebody could be having an awakening. So, there also could be, like, there was a painful ending in this situation. Somebody's at the, like, now somebody need to make a decision here because somebody knows somebody lied about something. Maybe somebody's lying on you or there was some untrustworthy situation. Wow. We got a guardian is with you here manifesting something. Tell the universe what you want. A lost loved one is watching over you. They're telling this person, they're telling them, tell them what you want. So somebody could be manifesting to change residence, moving. All right. Somebody could be moving or has moved. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, what is the message? Mercury retrograde, communication issues, reviewing everything, pregnancy. So somebody could have got somebody pregnant around Mercury retrograde and they reviewing everything. Maybe something is changing in that situation. What else? Distance. Give it time, it says. So you and your partner could be physically and emotionally distant right now. And I'm saying give it time because something is too challenging. 
Yeah, somebody's being your guardian, guardians or and stuff is saying, give it time. Everything in divine timing, let it flow. Let things flow. Because right now, there's some sort of electronical issue or communication issue or whatever. Some There's something that's up for review. Distance. And distance is needed or there was some distance here because something is up for review. Hmm, distance. What else? Ah, uh, so health is, is an issue because of somebody's a liar. Health issue could arise. So distance is happening because somebody has to learn not to lie. Okay, be careful. Someone is sneaky. So somebody could have lied or something. And that's just brought some sort of, like I said, dark night of the soul awakening or whatever. Like say God put somebody in your life, okay, that was prone to narcissism, um, emotional abuse, um, trauma binding, you know, stuff of that nature. So those say those was this person's trait. Um, this person has to learn certain things in order to come into, uh, be ready, right? They have to have certain kind of structure and discipline to move things forward. And there, there could have been some, uh, the health of the connection could have been because of somebody was a liar. They could have lied. Okay. About something. Could be a fire sign here. All right. Or earth sign took a gamble. Fire sign could have took a gamble here with an earth sign to do a love spell. Vacation and gold digger with the air sign. So somebody was trying to, so a fire sign could have been in charge of causing some sort of problem something for earth sign take it as a race resonate y'all but there could have been somebody trying to go on vacation be a gold digger air to an air sign take it as it resonates so they try an earth sign could have tried to do a love spell to go on vacation and get things from an earth an air sign i don't know but there was fire signs <laughs> earth signs and air signs so there was a problem here all right like that's crazy like how they breaking it down to the brass taxes of who, what, where, when, and why. So somebody could be getting clarity about something, okay? Um, why, like, the breakdown happened. Why something happened here? John B., that song. Listen to that song. Y'all know that song. That song old as hell. So somebody is uh, still operating out of an old paradigm or old way of being. Okay, whoever the fire sign, earth sign is or whatever. Maybe they told them to take a gamble and do a love spell. I don't know, to get something to go in their favor. But it actually ended something because whatever. I don't know. Somebody could have lied. Somebody was untrustworthy, right? Well, that's corny. <laughs> okay, untrustworthy friend. So that's where that uh, untrustworthy friend here so there's problems because of an untrustworthy friend here it told them to choose a certain path. But then it's like, why would you listen to that person to do such a thing? Okay. Somebody didn't know uh, they was going to fall in love with you or something like that. Let's get a couple of these cards here. We got karmic lover and, and denying something. So there could be problems now. The fire sign, earth sign, they could be friends or something like that. Take it as it resonates. Let me see what's going on. Let me get a couple of these cards before we go any further. Yeah, provoking. Wants to get provoke you to get a negative reaction. Arguing. Malicious. Wow. So somebody could have provoked someone to argue with you, arguing over something on social media, refusing to take responsibility, tries to ruin your reputation. So somebody could be trying to provoke you, trying to like argue with you and ruin your reputation about something. Yeah, this person is straight up lying here on why somebody is avoiding something here. 
Yeah, male detective is finding out about a karmic friend here being a scrub with a mean girl. You not being on the menu. This person tried to throw you under the bus here. All right. Could be like somebody tried to throw somebody under the bus about something with another female. What else? Mm, mm, mm. Only call or text when they want something. Opportunist. You could have canceled this opportunist. So you canceled plans with this opportunist here? Provoking an opportunist here. So, hmm. Joker. Easily triggered. Rotten. Karmic female here. What else? Follower doesn't want, does what everyone else is doing or expects. So, like I said, the fire sign could have um, told the earth sign, take a gamble and do the love spell so that you can go on vacations and get stuff from an air sign. So, this part, okay. <laughs> doesn't want to label the relationship here so this person could have been following something here following somebody like this is weird they provoke somebody to be an opportunist and got a negative reaction because they followed behind what somebody told them to do <laughs> right they could cause bad health to a situation when they lied selfish Looking for the next best thing. So this person is just looking for... This person could be selfish. Looking for the next best thing. Trollop. Sexual favor. So they could be dealing with people that do anything for money. For material items or money. Sexual favors for material items. So this is the person they could be... I know this ain't the kind of person that gave this person uh, advice. Like, come on. But, you know... So try to, what else, spirit? Now they concerned about the path they chose with somebody. Yeah, because now they having a nervous breakdown. They can't cope with the financial stress or they just can't cope. Deny, doesn't want to claim you in public or they denying something, denying the fact that they lied, that they a straight up liar, can't believe a word they say. Karmic family member here. Here we go again. Please, once to give you an, once another chance. Jealous and envious of someone's success. They got karma for that. Trying to be a leech. It was wasted somebody's time trying to argue with somebody. They feel jolted. Left at the altar here. Yeah. Because they took some sort of advice from a karmic male. That's a man child. So it's like now it could be two people arguing. Those two people could be arguing against amongst each other because they took this person advice. Like you told me I should do this shit. Now I done lost so-and-so and they concerned because maybe this was like a soulmate connection that you had with somebody or whatever. And they like, man, it ain't my fault. You know what I'm saying? Like you shouldn't have never blah, 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 say whoop energy like. Oh man, so they it could be somebody in their family or they consider as family. What else, spirit? So now somebody is they having a nervous breakdown here. Inconsistent. We got hot and cold. Money issues. Not on the menu. Someone doesn't want kids or somebody is having money issues. So, Mercury Retrograde, we did see that somebody could have got somebody pregnant or whatever. And whatever, whoever they got pregnant could have been somebody that do favors for money and stuff like that. And they was they could have met you, Collective, or they could have, something could have changed. Like, I don't know how this is going, but somebody, you know, was already having issues and they followed somebody that followed somebody's information that's selfish and shit. Now everything is all over the place. They follow a false, they confused. 
about a false spiritual first person being a spiritual thief and a gold digger, a frenemy that's diabolical. Oh, man. They listened to a bad parent karmic woman that was a trickster. Joker. They don't like being this way no more. Yeah, sexual items discovered. So somebody don't like to be like this no more. Concealed. They could be hiding it. Like, they don't want to be a joker no more. They're not comfortable with being like that. Like, somebody want a regular relationship or they want real love, but they they somebody could have came in fake or it was being fake with y'all or something like that. They got a lot of shit going on behind the scenes, Okay. Yeah. They could have been hiding it. They having their back is against the wall when it comes to finances here. Yeah, and they got served some karma here when they did something to y'all. Something could have even got even worse for them or something like that. Now this person is having a nervous breakdown because they can't cope. Shit is heavy on somebody, y'all. What's the message, please, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit? Karmic family member, the poser. Fake and happy relationship. So this is somebody they could have been taking advice from. A karmic family member that's a poser. Acting like they happy on online. Faking, I, that's why I don't, you know. You know how you see these um people here with the... Uh, with the, with the blogs and stuff like that. They blog in every second of their relationship. And, oh, it's so happy. Everybody's so great here. We don't have no problems. Like, <sighs> and then people that are single would see that like, man, I wish I had a man like that. And I wish my man did this. And I that, 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 that. But the whole time, it's just all for the camera. Like, I, who the fuck want to be in a relationship like that? That's ridiculous. Yeah, like this is malicious here. Mm -mm -mm. So, somebody's definitely was faking something online, acting like they relationship was all that or something like that. Malicious, refusing to take responsibility. These posers. Okay, habitual time waster. Somebody refuse to take responsibilities. Keep coming back into your energy with the same energy, but no offer. Bitter. Good guy going bad. This person is bitter. All right. Family standards here. They feel like they wasn't good enough here. Lessons. There's a big ass lesson at hand of somebody wasting someone's time trying to be a sweet talker. They're wasting their time trying to be a sweet talker here because they want something. Here we go again, please. Once another chance. But they're a fucking liar. So you could be avoiding this person and they mad at a trollop. They cause they feel like they intentionally destroyed this connection with you. And they pissed off now. So they could be talking shit here. Somebody could be talking shit about this person as wanting handouts. The convenience friend. Secret lover, something you don't know about a karmic lover here. Proceed with caution because somebody is easily triggered. They easily triggered this scrub, mean girl that was a thief, friend of me. So now somebody blaming something. It's like this person is not taking responsibility on what their actions was, what the reason why they may have lost you collective or the reason why, you know, it's like, this person had other shit going on. It's like this person don't, it hasn't, didn't change. They, they came in with the same energy and it's just like, no. Right? So they could be arguing with the, the person they got kids with or something like that. Something is, and you just could have washed your hands with the situation. Like, I don't, you ain't want that toxicity collected.
but this person could have been really trying to manipulate somebody with seduce seduction. <laughs> they were trying to manipulate somebody like they were trying to seduce you or something like that. Uh -uh. Yeah, this person definitely has some sort of eternal struggle here, personal challenge that's waiting for improvement. Like this person, this is what they do. This is how they are. They really going to have to work on it. Yeah. And then they wanted you to be compassionate after they did this to you. Like, oh, but I'm sorry, though. Okay. But if you're the type of person that didn't love yourself, you would fall for it. Like, okay, well, all right. Like, no. Don't settle for less. Don't you dare settle for just whatever. When you know it's not good for you or healthy for you, well, don't do it, collective. Remember, love comes from within first. Love yourself and you'll get that in return. You know? Yeah. We got the creator here. We got a catalyst, mother and father. Else. Yeah. Some of them is concerned now moving forward. What else? So we got sacrifice letting go. Something has something is over. Yeah, something could have came to it. Oh, child. So we got the creator here. Sacrifice. Reincarnation. Rebellion. Revelation. So somebody could be finding out something here. That this person was a catalyst here or you was a catalyst in the situation so that somebody could let somebody go like i said this could have started some sort of dark night of the soul some for somebody all right yeah for an anti-hero saying goodbye formal occasion i don't know what's gonna happen here with that but to this person that manipulated someone Compassion, kindness, spiritual realms. They know that somebody was stalking or watching you obsessively because of your energy and they having a problem. Eternal struggles. Somebody could be really needing help here because they could be really aggressively tracking somebody that's a sweetheart. Yeah. But maybe they wishing that, you know, your ancestors here or whatever they wishing for, your ancestors could have stepped in. God could have stepped in on a situation because this person could have thought that they was going to be able to do some strange shit. So this person could really be like a big narcissist, y'all. Like whoever somebody was that wanted you to get them a second chance, like this person could be a big, nar big narcissist, big time. Feel like they shouldn't have followed somebody's uh but like i said you were a catalyst in this creator this person could have been an energy vampire as well But, like, what kind of friend is you to tell somebody, like, oh, yeah, be a gold digger? Like, I don't care. Like, bitches, like, excuse me. Men or women, whoever this was. Telling somebody, oh, yeah, um, you can use that person for money or you could gold digger energy off of somebody. Like, don't do, like, oh, we're going to pretend you love somebody so that they, that's, like, so wrong. Like, why do people do that? 
Like, that's so weird. And why would you even listen to something like that? Provoking. They could have provoked somebody to have some sort of argument with you or something. I don't know why that or whatever they did that caused some sort of argument or whatever. Yeah. That's crazy as hell, y'all. I mean, and it's crazy. I'm I'm up here wondering, like, why all this money situation keep coming out? I forgot it's tax season. <laughs> I for, fucking forgot that these people, whoever these men or women is, they know it's tax season. Okay? And they doing the most right now because people getting their taxes back. So uh, it's a lot of fake love going on right now. So protect yourself. All right. And this person, it seems like they the kind of person that come back around, like you said, the same energy. They act like they changed, but they didn't. So be careful with this individual. All right. Because they're having money problems. You could be a hard worker, like, and they're having some sort of problems. And, and they, if people realize, like, but they don't, if, you know, if they don't love themselves, how can they love you? That's just first, y'all. They could, if this person doesn't love themselves enough to check themselves, they remember they avoid taking responsibility and all that and healing, then how the hell are they going to love you properly? You know? And if they want to be a whore, then, you know, then they can't, they, you don't, they want to be that kind of person that's a gold digger, then make sure you leave the money on the dresser and tell them to get the fuck on with their life. Since you don't, they don't see themselves as nothing else but... Uh, a sexual whatever sexual favors it says something about sexual favors the card says something about sexual favors um treat them as such if that's how they want to be if that's how they are you can't be faithful or loving on somebody in that energy because they don't even love themselves like ain't no fake love spending the night vacations or and if it is it's all it's it's just you just here for a good time, not a long time. So if that's how this person is rolling, male or female, take it as a resume show, then that's how you treat them. Ain't no extra whatever the fuck they was on. That's weird. Now this person having a nervous breakdown because somebody is just selfish. They they follow somebody that was selfish. So whoever they listen to, that karmic family member that could be even posing they can shit with somebody they got a family with online or something. But it just look good. Like, this is strange. Just <laughs> like, that's strange as hell. Like, why would y'all put yourself out there like that? Like I said, male or female. We got you. You got the job here. Somebody could be being childish because somebody got a new job or whatever. Sexual fantasies, blackmail. So somebody thought that they could blackmail somebody here or they're being blackmailed because they did get hired to do something. So now, boom, this is the thing now. So say somebody paid somebody to come towards you on some dumb shit, right? And they're being black, they're blackmailing the person that hired them. They're like, no, man, like you, I still, I'm still having money problems. Like I still need this money by tomorrow kind of energy. Their actions is catching up to them for catfishing you. Something came to a complete end. Halloween, somebody was doing a lot of spells thinking this was cute or something like that. I don't know. And now they seeing the signs that all them evil eyes from this obsessed person that was doing uh, spell work for them here. They thought they they celebrate. They could you could celebrate because they was missing a miss. They was missing a major piece, and that's why something is happening behind the scenes. Somebody seeing you change something that's changing for the better for you guys. And it's like, they wish they wouldn't have did that. They wish they wouldn't have played this game with you, right? We got blackmail. Someone is getting blackmailed. Someone is getting blackmailed. There's going to be a reason for you to celebrate. Hmm. Somebody was jumping to conclusions that their manifestations was within reach. It wasn't. 
That's why an altercation could have broke out because somebody was spreading rumors about somebody. So that's the trying to ruin your reputation energy. Now somebody was going to try to ruin your reputation or something, spreading lies or rumors or something. But somebody definitely getting blackmailed for something now. We're going to find out though, collective. Yeah, because somebody, there's going to be a reason for you to celebrate. Someone is desiring you here. What else? Something could have came to a complete end of somebody being obsessed with doing spell work. Yeah, because something has been married back to them into their relationship or into their whatever they got going on. So something came to a complete end of somebody being obsessed with doing spell work because something backfiring now. Something is being married back to them. So whatever spell work somebody was using to, I guess, confuse you, cause some sort of whatever breakdown, watch the breakdown energy. This person was being stubborn as hell with this idea they had. That was a bad idea, they realizing that. All right, give me this. Who is obsessed with you? Someone was obsessed with you. They were obsessed with something. This is over. Like I said, somebody found Koof in the beginning of the reading. I found... Somebody found there, like, all right, because I'm tripping. Like, it's getting too crazy. Something is getting crazy. It's even affecting their relationship and their life. This could be karmic family members. Shit is happening. It's like, man, somebody tired of being, even if this person was, like, um, like that joker energy, comfortable with being a hypocrite, comfortable with being mean, malicious. This person is starting to not be comfortable with that energy anymore. Yeah. They could have provoked somebody. Yeah, just don't be inconsistent. Do this, do that. Like, weird energy. Like, weird. All right. Let's see. You got the job. Got the job for what? Let's get here. Eternal love. Soulmate. Domination dictatorship so there could have been a soulmate that wanted utter control over something <sighs> we got promise here or this is confirmation they could have assured somebody that you will be homeless but now they got to proceed with caution because somebody was a third wheel enemy. That's remembering how they hit the jackpot here. Or that knows that somebody hit the jackpot here and got some money because they robbed somebody by trying to curse them with, with misfortune. Now they're awakened to something here. That they like, oh, so somebody knows what somebody did. Like whoever coached this person they chose you to do this, whatever. They wanted to curse you with misfortune so that they can have this. So this a soulmate here, a soulmate could have been tried to dominate a situation. Or told somebody, I promise you're going to have complete control over this soulmate or whatever. All right. They could have hired this person to get control over a soulmate and they promised them that they... They will get your blessings if if they did this this way, provoke some bullshit. Like, okay, so they would have to throw whoever you are. If you work, you're nine to five and you whatever, right? They would have to throw your energy off so that they can curse you with the misfortune. But even though they threw your energy off, it's some energy exchange. Like that energy that's not being used as far as you, you know, manifesting your life, your heart's desires, your this is that. Somebody else, a soulmate, is going to be able to do that for themselves. And they would get your good luck, good fortune. So it'll switch energy. And you would be the one having the money problems and all of this. Because your energy would be off. You'd be flustered. You'd be all over the place here. Okay. Something like that. That's what somebody's plan was to, yeah, cause some sort of supernatural disturbance so that it could be an energy shift, okay? 
Wow. That's what came out. Yes, that's what this soul made. And they was being stubborn with it. They was like, fuck it, let's do it. So they organized something. They planned something with somebody. Being arrogant, thinking about vacations and how they going to go on vacation. How they going to spend, be relaxing, being able to kick their feet up. Everything going to be great. That's crazy as all get out. <laughs> but now, since it didn't work. Because I, I would, this wouldn't be coming out like this. Somebody's blackmailing someone. So someone could be getting blackmailed. The person that was there. There it is. The person that smelt it, dealt it. Robbery. Now somebody like, no, now I'm going to blackmail you. All right? Because I couldn't take, I couldn't do it. Robbery is too hard to rob somebody. Yeah, this person... Like, I got all the, the transcripts of you networking, finding people, asking people to do this. Like, something like that could be on a laptop, computer, something like that. Somebody got information. Because now this person back against the wall, whoever they hired to do this, they like, I still, you know, like, I still needed that money or whatever. And they like, oh, we're going to figure it out. And he can't sweet talk this person. Like, somebody can't. If this was an ex of yours, they can't sweet talk the person that was planning to rob you or take something from you or curse you with diamonds to have control over you so that they can get whatever they wanted. That person can't sweet talk the person that came towards you. They're like, no, nah, man, like you, they could be at a party here. Probably they could have promised something here. Now they, child, wanting to hurt this person. Whoever this is, because they got evidence. And they like, no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm going to get you what you want, desires. So they could be making another plan. Like, all right, look, let's pretend, right, that you persevered through something here. And you chilling. But for real, for real, they are terrified because you're still getting these gifts. Maybe they're scared because they still owe this person something here. Yeah. Are you still getting gifts or whatever? Something is still coming to you? Because of your goodness and somebody's worried about their home, your real estate, your property, everything is okay. And this person wants to fight. I'm telling you, somebody want to fight this person that bribed them. Because you're still reaching your goals or something is still going good for you. So now somebody's going to blackmail somebody here. Blackmail, robbery, overload. Yep. Online community. So from whoever this uh online community is, okay. Whoever the introvert is or somebody is like scared, they this these people could be going within, they could be scared. I do feel somebody's nervous right now, yup. Yeah. Cause they 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 lack in sleep because of whatever it is their prayers they was doing, low vibrational prayers, some sort of ceremony. With a family that strategically coached somebody. Yeah, see. Yeah, this shit gonna get deep for somebody here. So I'm about to flip on somebody right now. Because the person that they wanted to do this is like... They done went through some karma, like... You know? And now they like, I still want my whatever. There's gonna be a reason for you to celebrate. Collective. There's a reason for you to celebrate. Now their enemy, that one they wanted to be your enemy, is their enemy now. There's a reason for you to celebrate. Celebration. Damn, there's something. Damn, man. It's not good. So, yeah, something that's not going to happen to you, collective. You, this person don't want to hurt you or something that's not going to end here for you. Somebody's very third wheel enemy is frustrated because they remember how you love yourself. That's why they fighting with this person. Now they're fighting the person that bribed them. So something not going to come to an end for you, whatever they was trying to harm you or in you or something. Celebrate that you can celebrate that, that you're good, collective, you're healthy, you're safe. Celebration. Yep. This is, I just heard hood justice. 
So this is some sort of karmic justice that's happening. And whatever happens to somebody that planned this, they're going to have some sort of hood justice or whatever. Uh -huh. Yeah, because they, yeah, damn. But this is good for you, okay? Um, you're getting karmic justice here. Somebody's getting logical now. All right, about what they created here is the reason why they lost this sweetheart. Yeah. And they could have, because their whole thing was to collect something to trap you or trick you. They was being arrogant here. Right? All in the illusion, but you can, they learning the lesson here. Lesson learned. You living, you learn. Because you're good now, and they're frightened that you won't get this good luck and everything is coming to you here and they they about to do some sort of ceremony on a family member that strategized or that was strategically planning something that coached them to do something now because now they, they know that this person quit okay so say somebody came towards y'all to do some do you something right they know um you're whoever you, the karmic family member is they know this person quit so now their intention is on them now they're desiring to end the family member that was obsessed with you. So that's the hood justice. That's the street justice that's about to play out. That's why somebody is paranoid. That's crazy, y'all. This is your karmic justice here for you not to be harmed or scathed or whatever. Yep out of somebody that was in their ego I know that's right whoever this is was in their ego trying to get your blessings they're about to have whoever this is about to have some sort of disturbance here alright supernatural shit going to happen to this person now they're praying to cause stagnation here to something that they wish for so this is like going to somebody Right, they trying to find out more information about this curse that they did or that they participated in to do to you collective because this is going they know that this is about to affect them really bad. Okay. Somebody knows that. Yeah. Damn. We got desiring. Yeah. Now they're just, they're wanting calmness and peace now in their life, inner peace. Now somebody's desiring inner peace here for a reader here, or but that's the fates here, fortune teller. All right, so they remember when a fortune teller here could have caused some sort of conflict with somebody here. I don't know who this is or take it as it resonates or when they got a reading done and they found out there was some sort of conflict with a bribe and reaching their goals. They could have promised that uh, you was going to be homeless if they scheduled to work together with an ally. They was at peace when they thought that you was going to be weakened and they would receive something with this networking. Something is changing desires. If something is really changing somebody whatever somebody was desiring is changing memory fate what else goals so maybe they got a reading they remember when a fortune teller said something about someone's purpose here remembrance coincidence purpose someone that was desiring you is remembering something they feel like ain't this a coincidence that their goal was to do some fuck shit to you and they trained somebody to do something and they was okay with, with doing whatever the fuck whatever heinous crime this was they was okay with it yeah, they was okay with bullying you. They was okay with trying to hurt you. They was okay with gossiping about you. But they can be going through something now. Something came to a complete end. Of this promise, what they promised. It's over. Yeah. 
coaching somebody to do something. They worry because they're scared that something might happen to their blessings or something. So somebody has ended something. They promise something is over. Something came to a complete end of a promise. Yeah, I'm telling you, somebody is quitting. Something is over. We're helping somebody cause disturbances to your blessings. Somebody's promising now. Like, I quit. Helping somebody cause disturbances to you. They're not doing that no more. No. Yeah, attach some sort of disturbance to you so they, they can get luck and fortune. Nah. Somebody's trying to stop a wish that they did. Because <sighs> they feel like they're going to suffer from something. Nightmares, darkness. Because they was the one that cre paid somebody to create this illusion. They are afraid. Trying to find inner peace here. With magic, somebody could be trying to do magic now to find inner peace because they see you being okay. Right? So whoever this is could have been somebody that was uh, family, somebody family member here that was a poser. They could have been mocking everything you did. They could have seen you as their competition if y'all do the same thing at work or whatever. But this person feel like, nah, like... I'm not helping you do nothing. I'm not helping you attach nothing to this person's gifts, doing no weird shit to this person, none of that. Because this person was obsessed with your energy collective. Obsession. Someone was obsessed with you. Yeah, they was obsessed with bribing people to help them do stuff to y'all so that they can get victory and success with causing you natural disasters. Something backfiring on them. This person was obsessed with doing stuff to y'all. Putting you at risk. This was a big risk. Obsessed with bribing people. Whoever this is, it's over. Mm-hmm. To do something to this sweetheart. Like, that's crazy. Yeah. So, there's conflict for somebody, family member, that overindulged in this. This could be somebody in your family, somebody in their family, but it's conflict now. They overdid something. It was like an ongoing thing. Back to back to back or something like that. Like they didn't want to stop. Obsession. Trying to steal your blessings. Yeah, look at that. Now somebody's like, please, they begging for inner peace at this time. <sighs> for real. Somebody like, this is too much. Like I just want somebody is kept bribing somebody. And doing they like I just I want I want inner peace and then because this ceremony ritual, you still are everything is okay with you. They thought this was okay to be a third wheel enemy. All this evidence, somebody knows that somebody did something just for merit, or just to have the one up over you. They thought this would be a good idea to try to bind somebody. Somebody pissed off for even supporting this people. The car injure you. Somebody feel like they're in danger because they they want to fight the coach now because they're a fucking liar. Yeah. Talking about some luck was on their side or that they would get reward to cause stagnation to something that and this was a nightmare to some people. And somebody like, no. Oh. So it's like this online community been coming up a lot, right? And somebody like I need to um I need to figure this shit out because bad shit is happening to somebody behind the scenes collecting. I'm gonna pull a couple of these and we done, honey. Yes, look at this hater. Somebody is definitely thinking about you. Romantic love affair. There's somebody that got feelings for you right now. Yeah, whoever you are, you could be a queen rising, stepping into your power. And this person, whoever this other person is, fam, fake, whoever they was doing, whoever these people are, somebody was just hating on you, and they know that. But somebody else don't hate nothing about you, like, and it's like, y'all fucking weird, yeah. Somebody felt like they going to jail, we got the police here. Somebody could really be getting in trouble for something. You could have called the cops, or somebody felt like that you could call the cops on them. 
I'm telling you, somebody got photo evidence, photo proof here on something. This situation is about to blow up and explode here. Pop off. Shit is about to pop off here. Yeah, I told you. Somebody really got feelings for you. And you could be uninterested in this person. Yeah, keeping a promise, rejection, digging up dirt here. They like, I'm not keeping a promise to find dirt on this person. They don't got no fucking dirt. So this is like somebody that wants you to be fake so bad. They want you to be fake like you're not a good person so bad. They want to expose something that's not there. So it's like somebody, it got to be something. And it's like, no, it's nothing. <laughs> like this person is a good person. Whoever the queen rises is. Once upon a love story. This is somebody that you could have, that you wasn't interested in here. Player. Because they're a player. Come on, man. And somebody don't want to hear it. This player... Whoever this is, they sent towards you. Don't want to hear anything that the other people got to say. Like, no. Look at this. Somebody definitely going to jail. Somebody not going to be able to cock block you no more. Cock blocking you was like the worst thing I feel like they feel like they could have did. This was their worst nightmare, trying to cock block you, steal something from you. Whoever this is, is a person that want to be you, wants to be you acts like you, dress like you, so that's who this person, they could be trying to be you whoever this female is, they could be selling sex online or they could be doing sexual favors just so that these people or this person could do something to, do you something or something like that and this person won't expose them they the one that's doing fuck shit yeah, they did all of this in their ego and somebody was confused, like what the fuck like what are we doing here your light was irritating this person's demons. Whoever been stalking you gonna have legal issues because they're getting kicked to the curb. Somebody don't fuck with them no more. Collective. Whoever they sent towards y'all, they don't fuck with this person. Mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody don't want to hear it. Keeping it that. You're like, they like, no, don't tell. No. Somebody like, I'm not trying to hear it. I'm telling. Yep. Damn. Recording, they're gonna put that on blast here. They're gonna put somebody on blast for whatever they plan on doing to y'all. Hooked. Somebody's not hooked on this person. They got bad habits and toxic ways. Yeah, they like shh, keep it silent, move in silence. They like, no, I'm telling everything. So somebody that is tired of being, they like, no, I'm telling. I'm telling everything. You the one that's gonna be exposed. Damn. Yep. Wow. Obsessive lover. Dangerous. Toxic. Unhealthy. Karmic. Got kicked to the curb here. Yeah. This ain't a game. Sports in the reverse. So somebody not playing games no more. They know that this person is dangerous. Whoever this male or female is. That's why somebody's scared. Because this person promised. You know. Yeah. Cyberbullying in the reverse. They not doing this shit no more. To cock block you or none of that. So somebody got a lot of evidence on somebody that was cyber bullying you, planning to rob you, take something from you, doing all this shit. Somebody's not um, going to keep that concealed anymore, collective. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Yeah. Fighting for what they love. Claiming what yours love is a battlefield. Ghosting. Disappear. Ghosting. In and out. So somebody could have ghosted somebody. Somebody want to fight for you? Yeah, wow. Dodging a bullet. Whew. You could have dodged a bullet here. Block negative energy. Escaping crazy people. All right. Same shit, different day, energy, hustling. This person could be like a hustler or something like that. Riding the wave here. Somebody getting bad karma. They could be threatening somebody here. Damn. Facts. So this person, no facts, had never has the facts making shit up. So people was somebody was making a lot of shit up to, about you here. You being going to the gym or this person stay doing stuff here. Meeting someone at the gym. This could be somebody you met at the gym. 
staying longer hours does more than working out. They could have been lying, saying that. Oh, no, you ain't going to the gym. You doing other shit. You was working out for real. <laughs> like somebody really was doing the most, trying to ruin your reputation. We got runaway, groupie, extremely triggered. This person is extremely triggered. Girl fight, whoever she is. Girl fight, arguing, competing with you at war. Whoever that is, they're extremely triggered right now. They're being seen as a groupie. Somebody could be threatening them right now. You yeah, hustling, making it rain. So they threatening somebody. If they don't give them their fucking money, that's how this is. But this is her bad karma for being a weirdo. Whoever this chick is that was trying to compete with you. So whoever making it rain, focus on getting to the bag. Somebody, whoever they hired to do all this, is now threatening them. They want their money still. So, And they not going to move in silence. So that's the blackmail. Like, I'm going to tell everybody. I'm going to go to the cops and give them photo proof. I'm going to give them all the documentation that you was uh, threatening this person. You was trying to, like, I got receipts. Somebody got receipts and they're willing to go to the police with it. Somebody is willing to set this person up because they know they did something out of their ego trying to curse you. Now, it's, they not going to, oh, because of, oh, well, you know, they did a curse. and No, they're going to show tangible evidence that has that will could get, could get somebody arrested. Like, as far as, like, we're stalking, um, paying for, what's those things? Somebody could have even been paying for, um, you know how they put your name in the thing and they look up where you live. Like somebody could have been doing that, trying to pay to get, find out where you live, your home address, so they can bum rush you at your house. Like this person did a lot and whoever they worked with, they didn't get nothing out of it. Somebody could have fell in love with the queen rising love story, right? And they still didn't get anything out of it. And it's like, no. Like, and, and I got my heart broke. And I really like this person. No. Like, no. Somebody feel injustice. They feel like it's they shouldn't have listened to this person. They shouldn't have helped this person do this. They just like, no. Because this person is the one that's toxic with bad habits. And you're just stepped into your power. And this person could have been hating on y'all. Yeah. So, yeah, new moon, K, first, last, middle, initial, yours or theirs. They like, no, nah, man. So, it's some hidden shit that this person is doing. They don't have the ability to uplift the heart around them like an angel on earth. They know they're not born to shine because of the energy that they in. That shit crazy. What's the message, please? Yeah, you learned this lesson. Let it go. So somebody learned their lessons. They can't believe they messed this up. Your child's father failed you and they sorry. Yeah. With a karmic woman. They see you are powerfully aligned with Jesus and other ascended masters. You're at a crucial point in your journey where you have to go beyond all previous setbacks. Yeah, somebody only wanted money. A Gemini. I can't get over you or I can't believe he messed this up. WAP energy. We got, they are shook because all blockages are going to be removed from you. We got your child. You're never alone. A year ago. They can't get over you at all. This week, full moon. We got WAP at the bottom of the deck. Somebody was trying to block They're going to be blocking a third party From wishing ill will on you New moon Pisces We got a mother figure Your mother, karmic woman So a Pisces could be Their mother could be a karmic woman Or their karmic could be a Pisces Take it as it resonates They was trying to block you Your mother's true love Are A, B, C, and D 
So you could have grown children that was involved in this shit. Your life wasn't easy on purpose because you're a king or a queen. You're destined for greatness. Somebody definitely has low vibrational energy here. So they know you don't have low vibrational energy, whoever you are, collective. So the sounds is too much. Somebody want to text you. They want to talk to you. Yeah, because they feel like they made a bad choice here. Something is in God's hands. They feel like, yeah, and the earth sign could be in love with you. Yeah, and God is blocking all bad energy. We got a Sagittarius H Narcissist. Damn, somebody want to be with you so bad. All right. Maybe they don't want to be with K no more. All blockages are removed in a reverse for them. Um, Sagittarius. Shortcut deep waves or a bald head five years ago. Somebody's mom didn't like you. They created a mess and was hoping somebody can help them fix it. Somebody got a red car. Could be a Libra. They going, damn, Z. They could be trying to poison you or they put poison in your food or drink. Like, that's how mad somebody is at this person. They work with this person to do you something. So now this person, like, since this person could drink, they got bad habits. They could drink a lot, party, whatever. They like, no, nah. like, they feel some type of way, y'all. I'm serious. Yeah, because somebody was a soulmate of yours, and you had a divine bodyguard. Maybe trying to poison somebody, or they thinking about poisoning somebody that would try to do you something. Or that was in competition with you. I didn't mean what I said. Somebody with a white car, P. Soul contract. They all in their head and they feelings right now. In the next 48 hours. About this soul contract. Oh. E. This person wasn't going to tell you what had, was going on, but shit, they salty as hell right now. They going to tell. Because they was planning to rob you. Yeah. Somebody with a light color vehicle. Or that's what they're doing now. They're planning to rob somebody with a light color vehicle. Somebody that got dreads, dreads or braids. This is giving like when networking go wrong. Because somebody is, is crazy for real. Crazy. We got a father here. I J K and L. Somebody may, may be telling their dad like what's going on because they could be nervous now. Mm -hmm. We got an Aquarius. That song A. That song was for you. Somebody is stressed out, so some song could be playing. All right. Oh, Aquarius. That song. John B. Okay, Aquarius could be trying to sing you a song in energetically right now, Libra. Yeah, you about to get a pay raise. Because he not setting her up no more. Somebody with a blue card. It was a suicide mission. They've been caught. Somebody that had a BMW, Nissan, Kia, or Audi, or Honda could have been caught. It was a suicide mission. Yeah, somebody can't stop missing you. I'm so attracted to you, but you're hard to get next to. Oh, love. T. Leo has an STD. Or Leo STD. They low-key jealous of you. This person could be physically or verbally abusive because you opened your heart to new love, a Taurus that was destined. No. Mm. So, yeah. I hope this helped you. 